And again, the Tar Heels are moving in that direction. Coleman goes down low to McDaniel. Back outside to Mavunga, who hits a deep two from the right baseline. Some more assists to her stat totals. She comes onto the court. Big steal by Diamond to Shields in traffic. Two behind the back moves, and she draws a foul. Gray steals the inbounds pass. She had a tight guard on Sims, and she'll go coast to coast with contact, makes the layup, and will have a chance at a three-point play. What a great play by Alicia Gray, going coast to coast, staying on her strong side, the left-hand side. Out to clears with a little pressure. Tar Heels able to break it. They free up Diamond to Shields for a reverse layup, and this one falls through. Whistle as McDaniel wrestles it away from Sims. Two on two the other way as DeShields fakes the pass and then takes it in for a layup all on her own. 11 seconds to go, a 43-24 lead. A pass ahead to Washington as she will fire the three-pointer with four seconds to go, and she nails it from way outside. King to Coleman. Coleman finds Roundtree, who almost whips a pass back to the top of the key. Instead, they go down low. Reverse layup for McDaniel is good. She got the feed from Mavunga. Nice high-low possession there by Mavunga. I'll just summarize it and say she's just been a great hustle player for North Carolina, doing all the intangibles. Offensive rebound on the second miss from Gray by Brittany Roundtree, and then she's fouled on the putback here in the second frame. They break the press, and Gray tries to knock down a three-pointer. It's no good. Danielle Butts with the rebound in traffic. Gray gets the rebound for the Tar Heels. Lead pass to Bryant, one-on-one -on -one with Jordan, as she takes it in and lays it in off the backboard. Again, Alicia Gray providing the action, getting the rebound, a nice outlet pass to India. Danielle Butts near the top of the key. She sends it to a flashing diamond to Shields, who sends a pass down low to Stephanie Mavunga. 106 to 52 is our final score as the Tar Heels let the clock wind down. A big 54-point win for UNC as they go to 3-1 on the season.